Abby, great start one, two for the LA Current. Thank you, yes, I'm so excited. That was awesome. Um, we just wanted to go out and get one, two. We know we could, so we're excited. It was really tight at the end, but it was your teammate. Yeah, of course, I saw her coming. I was like, I'm the front half, she's the back half, we knew that going in, and we are like, I'll pull you out and you pull me home, so it was kind of just fun. Well done, we'll see you later. I mean, I am indeed. Sheridan, your second win, the 50 and the 100 back. Yes, sir. Yeah, that was a fun race to do it. And it's awesome to do it for the Condors. I mean, they're a great team to be part of, and it feels like family. We're back home, and I'm excited to be back with the ISL. Talking of family, whatever your brother you can do, you can do too? I wouldn't say that. I mean, I still look up to Caleb, and we're different swimmers. We do different things, but it's always fun having him around. So That was awesome. Look forward to seeing in the skins. <laughs> yeah, oh, gosh. It's my first time doing the skins, but... I've heard it's a lot of fun. It's definitely a lot of excitement, a lot of competitiveness. So we're ready to get after it. Go get ready. Thank you. Coleman, how does it feel? World record. Amazing. I'm at a loss for words right now. Fastest man on the planet. It's unreal. I mean, I like. I don't. I don't, I don't know what to say. I'm just so happy right now. <laughs> Twenty-three four out. That was fast. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I'm just happy I was able to finish it. Oh, man, I'm tired. <laughs> well, listen, go and enjoy it. Let it sink in. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm here, I'm here with the head coach uh, of the Cali Condors, Jeff Julian. Jeff, how exciting does swimming get? How good was that? This is, this is fantastic. I mean, they've, they've come in ready to go putting all excuses aside, just being focused on getting things done. Putting the mind there, these guys are talented swimmers, professional swimmers, and they're getting the job done. And you're getting big jackpots. What's that? Big jackpots. A huge jackpots. I mean, we're, these guys are all together. This is truly a team event. Those guys getting the jackpots are, are huge standouts for us, but they're doing it for the team the same as everybody else. This has been a huge, huge team event for us, and it's showing. Talk me through Coleman Stewart's 100 backstroke. I mean, that was glorious. Ah, oh, it was beautiful. We knew it was coming. He had a lot of events. He swam the 200 back throwers yesterday. Still broke the American record. We knew he had a lot in him. So it was, we knew it was coming, but it's always fun to watch. I mean, he was good last year. I remember watched him in a lot of races, but he's just taking it to another level this time. Oh, he's loving it. I mean, he loves, he loves the sport. He loves racing. He came in ready to go. I mean, he was focused. Well, looking, welcome to the ISL. You've taken over from John T. Skinner. Was that a difficult decision when Jason asked you to be head coach of the Cali Condors? You know what, it, it, a little bit of personal side, I was supposed to be head coach last year actually. I had a health issue, so this is very personal and, and rewarding for me to be here, it means a lot. So these guys are, I mean, this is, this is, I'm like a kid in a candy store here. This is fun. Welcome to the party, Car may it carry on. Thank you, thank you. Hey Lily, another swim, another win. Please with that one again. Yeah, that was good. Uh, yesterday after the two breasts was a little rough for me, so. I wasn't really sure how this one was going to go, but it went pretty well, I think. With another three meets to go, are you going to get close to that world record? <laughs> Maybe not during the regular season. I'm trying to save that one for the final. <laughs> awesome. Well, another great swim and, and another great jackpot. Thank you. Hey, I'm Paul Side now with Dave Solo, head coach of the Tokyo Frog Kings. Great victory, Kaseki there. Uh, we're looking pretty good so far. We've got some surprise swims. Our turn of butterflies, Leah Gingrich, uh, was outstanding. And uh, God, we, we just coming back today. Uh, we, we've got tattooed arms today with it says Inspire. We've asked the kids to inspire each other and inspire the coaches, and uh, pretty happy about it. And they seem to be, I like your charm. You're clapping in your frog jump. Oh, yeah, we, yeah, we started that last year, and everybody kind of laughs at it at first, but now once we get into it, it's pretty cool. That looks really, really cool. Seto's looking good today as well. Yes, he looks really good. He came in this year with an intent to help this team uh, rise to the top, and 100 IM was a little short for him, but uh, 400 and 200 IM are good. We're looking for a 400 IM victory. And then 23 points between you and LA Current. Yes. Got a few more good swims to come. You think you can chase them down? So. 400 IM looks good. I think the skins is going to be telltale. We've got uh, Takeshi in the uh, 50 backstroke for the men. He was really good last year in that. Uh, so I think he's going to capture some big points there. So everything's going well. Awesome. Good luck. Dave, 
things are tightening up, getting exciting. Yeah. <laughs> Real tight, yeah. I think it's one of these meets that uh, it was what to be expected, which uh, Tokyo is a very good team. And uh, they have some real superstars, and we have some stars too, but it's, uh, it's really coming down to the last couple of events. Uh, we hope we have some uh, special energy for skins. We just pulled Ryan Held off the bench and said, let's give it a go in a 50 back. So uh, I think we're piecing it together, but uh, the good thing is t uh, today is better than yesterday. I think it's what you saw in the first match. I think everybody's finding their footing a little bit. And obviously the addition of Maddie Wilson to our squad this year has been a true blessing. She's got uh, an a great attitude and a great example and brings a little bit of that Aussie uh, swagger too. You've had a few good wins today, obviously, and as you say, some of the swimmers are not such good form, so you're putting the jigsaw, jigsaw piece together. But a few more races to go. Have you got enough to stay ahead of the Tokyo Frog Kings? I believe we do. 4 9 is very important coming up right now. And uh, we've been to men's side, we have two guys that it's not their favorite event. And on the women's side, we have one that's her, her favorite event and one that it's not, but they're very talented. So uh, I think 4 9 will set things up in a, in a big way. I'm not sure how deep all the, uh, the Tokyo or, uh, or, or we will go into the skins. So it'll be more a matter of getting through the first round. And if we get anybody in the second round, uh, it'll be very good. So it's going to come down to, it could be a one point match. We might even be having a 200 medley relay coming up. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking to Lenny earlier. He said you've got um, swimmers from 18 different nations here. Yeah. How are you communicating? Uh, through Lenny for the Russian guys. And uh, it, it's, it's really been, honestly, it's been a lot of fun. I mean, uh, Tom Shields has had one of the international swimmers from each day give a little uh, uh, saying and then lead the cheer for, for what we were doing for the day and, and so we could learn at least a, a word in their language. Uh, but actually it's a really good team. It's, and I think you're gonna see team chemistry come together here and be one of the strengths of the LA Current like it always has been. That's awesome. Well, listen, three more events to go. Good luck. Uh, next, the 400 IMs, then the skins. Abby, awesome swim, new British record. A what? A new British record. You broke Hannah Miley's British record by two seconds. What time did I go? I don't think I did. No, I don't think that's right. Oh well, oh well. Um, yeah, I was in a 400 medley at the start of the season. It's like so hard, but yeah. I'm glad I got it out of the way and like the first one's gone and I can keep going now. That, that would look tough, but you won it by a mile. I just think I've tried to like put it together for the breakers. Like we've got a good, the men's are strong now, and like we knew that if we just tactical and gain as many points as we can and just build on it, it's meet to meet. So yeah. Great job, well done. Thank you. So, so Daya, that's another. It's your fourth victory for the weekend. Another great swim. Fourth victory. Yeah, uh, I'm so happy, but I want to swim uh, 3.56, so five seconds uh, later, right? So. so over the next few weeks, you're going to get faster? Yeah, yeah I, I hope. <laughs> you're looking good at the moment, and the, the team atmosphere seems really good. Yeah, I think so. so and yeah. <laughs> Enjoying your new team. Yeah, yeah I'm very so uh, fun. <laughs> you have the best team chant with the frog jump. <laughs> yeah, interesting. Yeah. We look forward to seeing some more fast swimming over the next few weeks. Thank you. Got <laughs> it. Okay, so there we go, the Cali Condors win, a very dominant display, 707 points to the LA Current's 402. 300 points is a long way. Tokyo Frog Kings pushed the LA Current close into third place, but I'm here with the Cali Condors, the champions of the day. Got your, uh, your, your match under a great start. Um, first of all, Coleman Stewart, world record. Now you've had time to think about it. How was that 100? It was awesome. I mean, there's definitely a few things I can clean up, but uh, overall, I was not expecting to come in here and break a world record, so I'm, I'm just shocked and really still at a loss for words. <laughs> and for those people out there, that when they think to clean up, what do you mean by that? Because obviously when you're in it and you're in the swim, your brain can take on so many things. What things can you do better? Well, in America, we do yards and these flags are in meters. So I got to get back to yard or back to meters, get that yards out of my head. And that's 
I think other than that, I, I had a pretty good race, but just I was long into the, definitely the third wall. And last year you had some great swims, but this year you've just taken it to another level. What have you done different? Nothing really. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Like we, I took a few weeks off after Olympic trials and came back. And I think the only difference is I'm in good shape, but I'm not beaten down from training yet. So yeah, we'll see how it plays out over the next few weeks, but I'm right now I'm just top of the world. <laughs> and talk us through the skins. I mean, I was a 50 swimmer. I could make one and then I'm out. I don't care if you go again, but you made that look easy. It was not easy. I'm definitely in a lot of pain right now, but Justin is in a lot more pain than I am. So I have that going for me. <laughs> yeah, that was a little bit brutal, jackpotting him like that. He's been beating me long course for a long time. I got to take it where I can short course. So, <laughs> so we got th it's the end of this match, three more matches to go. Can we see some faster swims from you? I have no idea. <laughs> Hopefully, but uh, yeah, we'll see where it goes and head down for the next uh, few days, get back to training, and then be back here in a week. And the guys tell me you can also swim a good flying freestyle. Yeah, uh, hopefully Jeff will give me a, a shot in a few matches. Uh, but yeah, excited to see my flying free if I get the opportunity. For the moment, congratulations, MVP, taking out the great Caleb Dressel. That must feel good on the same team, though, but well done. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Caleb is an amazing team leader. He's an amazing guy. Um, and he was the first one to congratulate me. So he's just, he's really what I aspire to be. He's just an awesome person, really. Well done. Look forward to seeing more from you. And Jeff, you must yes. be really pleased with your team. What a great start. Oh, I'm ecstatic. I mean, they, they came in ready to go, and it was just fun. Every heat, heat after heat, event after event, they were just on and pushing, pushing each other. And even the ones that we didn't have great to swim, the team was there and we just kept pushing. We just kept staying together. It was fun. Yeah, you've really set your stall out. You come out really, really quick. I mean, some of the other teams seemed a little bit sluggish. Your guys started really well. I, th I think we started well, absolutely. We're not going to compare against anybody else. We're just going to look to build and get better from here. So they're going to have to keep up. And what does better look like? Look, they came in like, like Coleman. They came in with all over the place. He went to trials and then got back into training and he's ready to go. All of them though are, are there and, and we've talked a lot about mindset and we talk a lot about getting up and, and racing with that and, and taking the years of training. I mean, Coleman's up to years. He's not doing anything different, except now he has a little bit different of a season approach to really take advantage of years and years of hard training. That's what I see and that's what I see for a lot of our swimmers along the way. I think they can get to that level of racing. And it means a lot to you guys, you won last year but you want to really want to retain this title. I know we're in the, the prelims, so to speak, long way to go, but you, you really want to win again, right? Oh, absolutely. I mean, that's, that's what this league's about, is coming in, coming in and being the best of the best. I mean, this is the best in the world, and coming in and being the best of the best and putting those times up, that's what this is about. And we've, we've started now. We have no plans to slow down. Well, well done today. I know there's a lot more racing to go. Well done, you. World record. I want to see another one. But congratulations. So we have it. The Cali Condors were victorious. They won by a mile, by 300 points, but this is only match one. There's another eight matches to go before the playoffs and the semis in Eindhoven, and then the final comes next year in January. But for now, thanks for watching. See you again next week.